Hey guys, Rick with SeeMyBeach.com. We're here today. This is, when I say world famous, Key Lime Sailing Club and Cottages. This is the most awesome place you'll ever go. Uh, talking about amenities, you can even get a sailboat with your room. It's insane. We're here today because Paul, the owner, called me because they have a special guest. And uh, we want to highlight that guest. He said there's a dog here that's a rescue dog kind of famous and you know when you say dog I'm on my way so here let's go over here and let's meet Keb how you doing young lady very good good what's your first name Suzanne Suzanne how you doing today I'm Rick with seemybeach.com okay nice to meet you excellent so this is Keb this how you doing Keb, Keb? First... it's a little hot here in Miami or in, the, in Florida yeah me too Keb we're, we're used to the Pacific Northwest. Oh, okay. It's, it's a little warm here. we got to get yes. some doggy love out of the way first, and then we can talk. Yes. Uh, we, we prioritize everything at SeeMyBeach.com. Of course. Okay, yes. so tell me a little bit about Keb and what's going on here. Let me get on the other side of here because with the lights kind of dark okay. on you there. All right. All right, go right yeah. ahead. So Keb is actually not a rescue dog. She's a search and Oh, excuse dog. me. Okay. Yeah. Oh, gotcha. So she's been certified in avalanche, in disaster, in wilderness, in human remains detection. Okay. And she works primarily in the Pacific Northwest. We are out here because she won the 2022 American Humane Search and Rescue Hero Dog Award. Okay. And on top of that, she is the main feature, main character in A Dog's Devotion. Well, look at that. Which is a book I wrote that was just released three oh. weeks ago. Okay. Number one new release on Amazon in law enforcement. Awesome. You know, we have a new section on our site called Shop and Explore, and you'll be able to shop for that book right on SeeMyBeach.com, and it'll link you to your Amazon. All right. Absolutely. <laughs> new session we just put up, so you're just in time for it. Yeah. Let me get back over here and look at Kev for a minute here. Kev, you're just so pretty. You're such a sweet baby. Yeah. Oh, you're a little hot. Would you like a little snack? Yes. She likes snacks. I'm, I'm hot all the time in the, yeah. in the Keys and in these areas. Yeah. So anyway, tell me, is there anything else about uh, Keb you want to tell everybody about and just about dogs in general, about your mission? Well, she's been on over 100 missions. Okay. You know, ranging from we've been dropped by helicopters on Mount Rainier. She was deployed on the Oso landslide, which is the largest landslide tragedy in Washington State's history. Right. Over 43 people died, and she actually had three uh, fines on that particular mission. Um, she also deploys on um, um, cold cases, crime scenes, so she's solved nine-year-old uh, cold cases where she found, for example, the mandible of somebody and they were able to do the dental forensics and bring an answer to the family, finally, wow. after nine years. A detective dog at that, look at that. Yeah. Awesome. So, yeah, she's been an awesome dog. She was, you know, very carefully selected for her working lines and... Um, She's right. a very methodical dog. Well, when people think about dogs, they think about just petting dogs and loving dogs and things like that. And some people don't even like dogs, which are just, is just disturbing. Those are those people are what you call sick. But yes. anyway, I don't yes. even mind saying it at all. But if you don't love dogs, you guys have some serious psychological problems that is not fixed. Yes. Not not not. Don't even try to fix it because yes. you're beyond it. So, Absolutely. but anyway, but yes. dogs come help us in so many different ways. The canine dogs and all the different dogs, and it's just amazing what they provide to our lives, just in general. Yes. And when a, when a Paul called me this morning. This is usually the time of day when I'm like justifying 15 more minutes sleep. I'm never up this time of day. Oh my God. <laughs> he, he said, how you doing? What's your name, sir? My name's Scott. How you doing, Scott? It's my husband. That's your husband? Yeah. Gotcha. I, I knew if he was just a stalker or just your husband. <laughs> well, yes, yes, I'm both accounts. You're some of both of those, huh? <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Well, you know, anyway, so, uh, but when he said dog, I'm like on my way. So, you know, oh, excellent. I, Good. This, you know the highlight of my life is hanging out with dogs and yeah. all that. And we're the crazy people who do videos with dogs and kids at the same time. And you usually don't want to do either one. Uh -huh. And we do both for SeeMyBeach.com because it keeps everything fun. Oh. And here comes Paul over here. Paul, come on over here for a second. You got a sec? Yeah. We're basically finished with the video. I just want to get my friend Paul in here. How you doing, Paul? How you doing? Paul is a long-term so sponsor and founding partner of SeeMyBeach.com, which means he puts heart and vision ahead of money and numbers and things like that. And that's, you know, rare with people. But Paul's always been like that. Always been a big supporter of support of helpin.litter.org. Yep. Supports everything that we do. And He's really means... a wonderful host. Oh, Absolutely. Isn't this, this a great place to stay? Oh, my gosh. He took us out on his boat. We saw the dolphins uh, jump around the... Awesome. Both, and we saw the pelicans on the rookery, and yeah, yeah, it was just fantastic. Yeah, was yeah. Awesome. When I brag about this place, people think I'm just being, you know, impartial, partial to my customers, but it's really, really a cool place. And it's a Key Lime has a special feel to it. And and I don't think Paul would sell this for anything. He's not one of these people that's like, here's a million bucks, here, sell your property, because he realized. 
realizes he'd be selling part of himself if he did that. Yeah. Now, I hope you don't have a sale pending when I say that, but <laughs> <laughs> I don't know anything on the inside, but uh, uh, Paul's a great guy. This is a great property here. And, you know, thank you so much for what you do. You know, we need people that, that have animals like this and, and protect the people and everything. And Mr. Stalker over there, <laughs> he's part stalker and everything for her, which I understand. She's gorgeous. <laughs> Anyway, so we're going to get over here and we're going to say bye to bye, my bye. little Kev. Kev, Kev. I'm already in love, yeah, sweetheart. Here, look, little snack uh, for the doggy. Yeah. Uh, a little Scooby such snack a there. Such a sweetie. Awesome. Yeah. We're right here. We're going to sign out here at Key Lime Sailing Club and Cottages. I know you guys have a flight to catch. Thank you so much for waiting yeah. so I can make it over here. Awesome. What's your name again, sir? Scott. Scott. Nice seeing you, Scott. Nice meeting you. Paul, always. See you guys again. I'll see you again tomorrow. Back by popular demand. <laughs> <laughs> Always the last show with Bob. Y'all take care, guys. We'll talk to you later. Key Lime Sailing Club and Cottages, one of my favorite places in the world. Look at this out here. Gee whiz. Amazing place. Take care, everybody, and we'll see y'all next time on seemybeach.com.